Well, Bri, it's a new day out at Tunqua Lake. Yeah, another day. At least the sun's out right now. Key word there is right now. <laughs> We're uh, very unsettled conditions. You know, we, we plan to be up here and then we got other shoots going on the weekends. But it is unsettled. You know, we are going to have some, we know we're going to get some squalls today. But we got a chance for decent sized fish. Yeah, and we're going to get some wind, but Tunko's famous for, it's in really good shape now. The Panask are back in the lake. They're growing big, you know, five plus pounds. Beautiful. All we got to do is find them and figure out how to catch them. <laughs> Excellent. Well, that's today on Tunko Lake as we take you sport fishing on the boat. Sport Fishing on the Fly is brought to you by Maui Jim Sunglasses. First, Tellurium Corp, the future of mining. And Hardy, Rods and Reels. Right. Why do we stop here? Oh, we got some intel from the locals. <laughs> Johnny Wilkinson and, <laughs> and Kenny, Kenny Woodward said, there's an X out here, so <laughs> I found it. <laughs> so we found the X and we're starting here. Beautiful, and, uh, 12 feet of water and chronomets. Give it a shot. Yep. See what we got. Perfect. Let's give it a go. That was a solid hit. Oh, shallow water. Shallow. <laughs> We've had to push way up out of the wind. Yeah, get out of the wind. Nice fish to start, though. Oh. Oh. Long lime relief. Tiny chronomet fell out. <laughs> <laughs> so we've had to hunker out of the wind. A little green red butt, 16. But the bugs are just starting to hatch, and we had to come up in the shallow water to get out of the wind. Yeah. It's pretty rocking on Tunkwa today. <laughs> it is, but that's what you have to do, right? You gotta yep. find shelter and find the fish. Yep. Well, you bet. keep getting the small crannies. See bulldogs over there using other stuff. So we'll see, he's our guinea pig. <laughs> that's a good fish, Bri. That's better. That's Come a nice on. Jump, fish. jump again. Oh, yeah, that was a beauty. See him flashing down there. So, what did he eat, Bry? Static what did he... bag with maroon rib. Ah, okay. Yeah. Nice. Well, there's lots of cronies coming off now, so hopefully, hopefully, they're starting. It's been a slow morning, lots of wind. So we're hunkered down in here. Oh, 
Lots of cold wind. Cold wind, <laughs> yeah. There's a difference, wind <laughs> and cold wind. Oh, he's a nice fish, Brian. Oh, head shaker. Yeah. Oh, he's gorgeous fish. Beauty. Yeah. Oh, that's the beauty. Oh. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, oh, nice fish, bro. Ooh. That's a good one to start. That's a beauty. Oh. <laughs> That's a beautiful trout. Oh, is it ever? <laughs> Look at the condition of them. It's a beautiful panask. Yeah. Yeah, a nice fatty. Calm down. Have a out. quick look, Don. Yeah, let's get a quick boat sample. Yeah, see what he's eating. Oh, yeah, we got a whole that guy up. That is. Oh, uh, look at how fat. Chunky, chunky. That's a beautiful fish. fish. Beautiful, beautiful fish. There he oh, goes. Oh, gee. Oh. <laughs> All right. Oh. Let's see what he was eating, Brian. See if he's got anything in him. Yeah. Ah, you never know. Let's see. Oh, he's got a few. Yeah, few, eh? Oh, big one. Oh. Big green one. Big greeny. Well, he's starting. There's a big one on a big, big green. static bag. Yeah. Well, he might have put on a bigger static bag. Oh, hey, it's what pretty a big. beautiful crumb. <laughs> That's a big bomber. It's a, like a 12 2x. That is wow. Holy cow! Yeah, that's a that's a big one. <laughs> well, might put on a big one. Never know. Good catch, Fry. Yeah. Good start. It's great to see. <laughs> great to see. Boy, it's a grab all day. <laughs> the weather's gone bad. Oh, we got a loon here now. Oh, great. Had a blustery, windy day on Tonqua. Good ever. Holy cow. Nice fish, though. Yeah. Where is he? Come on. Loons after him. Yeah, loons <laughs> chasing him, eh? Oh, yeah. Oh, there he goes. He went down. Yeah, look at the loon down there. Oh. Too big for the loon. That's a nice fish, right? Beautiful fish. Beautiful. Oh. There he goes. Well, let's what head a... in and we'll come back yeah. another day. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Oh, man. She's a blustery She's day. She's blustery. Oh, man. Oh, what do you got there, Don? <laughs> well, that to change it up. We've got just nasty weather. We, yeah. You know, you got that beauty early on the chronomet. It was so nice. And then we've had to go over to the... You know, Dye's Buggy Prince had to go to the Type 3 line and fairly shallow the water back to six feet and search for him. We got this guy, nice fish. But he really pounded it. He ripped oh, it. I saw your rod yeah. buckle over. So that might be a good thing. 
<laughs> you know, we just put on Dye's buggy prints because Dale was having some luck with it. So, you know, we may have to change it up, Bri. We don't have that. We got the low pressure. We got nasty weather. Oh, yeah. You can look at the dark Ooh. clouds. Yeah. But here he is here. He's not a bad fish. He's actually quite nice. But the beauty here in Tonkwa, boy, they, they sure fight good, don't they? They're scrappy fish. Yeah. <laughs> really scrappy fish. Holy cow. This guy has been working hard. Well, you know, Dye's Buggy Prince is always a good one. Always seems to work. Come on, baby. I'll get him over here. Oh, he wants to go over there for some reason. Yeah. Okay, I'm getting them up. I'm getting them close. Right. Oh. There he is there. All right. That's a nice fish to start. Nice, nice healthy bull. I think he ripped it. Boy, yeah, he wanted it. He definitely wanted that. Guys, buddy. Oh, right there. It flies out. Let's hold him up for everybody. There he is, sir. Look at nice. Oh, one. gorgeous fish. Gorgeous gone. fish. Nice and gorgeous. healthy. Yeah. We should Little. probably throw Ooh. pump him. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> well, we could have, but I blew it. <laughs> Next one. We're going to get another one right now. Yeah. Next one. We'll throw Excellent. Cool. Be beautiful. Well, that was amazing. That was nasty. <laughs> I got no more clothes to put. <laughs> you were bundled. Well, the big squall just went through, so maybe we get a hatch now. Hopefully. Well, the water's flattened off. The bugs are starting to go, so maybe the fish will finally turn on. It's it's been tough. Oh, it's been tough, but that's what you got to do, right? We got to try different things in these yeah. tough conditions. You'll stick with the crony. I'll try dice buggy and. Look at the bulldog over there. He's got the, he's got a little fly in there. He seems to be getting a few. <laughs> he's all happy. All right, let's get some. Tough That's, situation. It's early though. You know, we're hoping for better weather to come. So squalls we'll coming through, hail, rain, wind. <laughs> Barometer's just going, <laughs> and then it's coming up, and then it's diving down. But still got the afternoon. That's right. It's early yet. Let's see this guy. Looks pretty good. Oh, a nice fish, Bri. Good starter. Yeah, static yeah. bag in maroon. Nice. That's 16. Small guys coming. Well, it's a mishmash <laughs> of, of chronovids coming off today. Whoa. But the fish aren't focused on them. Everything we've pumped, it's been a, I mean, we're even seeing shrimp in them. What the heck? <laughs> they came with the program. I know. <laughs> we don't want shrimp. <laughs> Shrimp's for the fall. Got him. Hell is he getting nice. Oh yeah, nice fish. That's a good start. Love the colors too, eh? Nice and chrome. Chrome yeah. fish. Beautiful. Upside down. In the beak. Ah, it's a nice. Nice tonkwa fish. Beautiful. We know they're a lot bigger in here though. Oh yeah, look at that. Uh, Gorgeous. Yeah, they are a lot bigger, but we'll get into those. That's oh, a good yeah, starter though, Brian. Good starter fish. We've had crappy five weather. Fish in this light, but yeah. I mean it's we're fighting a lot of environmental factors. Today. <laughs> I like yeah, that environmental. <laughs> no, that's oh, well. Yeah, well, let's I'll get some more. Let's, yeah, keep at her. Yeah, we got this other next squall coming in, but hopefully we're all right. We'll see. Oh, yeah. Well, that's a nice look at it. It's coming in. <laughs> <laughs> what happened to that fight? He jumped that was a an couple awesome bite. <laughs> I saw it go down. <laughs> that was a quick fight. Like he jumped four or five times big time and then down. Weird. Nice fish, though. Yeah, he didn't. He jumped and then came right in.
I know where my fly is. Yeah, I don't know either. I can't see it. Oh, okay. there it is. I'm just gonna do a quick... Quick throw sample? Yeah, I Get. better. Yeah, I better check. What do you have on right now, Brian? You got a, I think you got a chromie on. Tough to get that. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Okay. Yeah, hold him up. That's nice. It's starting to hail on us again. There's a beautiful, oh, beautiful yeah, panache. Gorgeous. Panache. Gorgeous. Yep. There you go. Nice. <laughs> well, let's see if he had anything in him, Brian. Let's see what he was chowing on. Well, they've been few and far between, but at least it's picking up a little bit yeah. this afternoon. Yeah, no kidding. So, uh, mm. have a quick look. Oh, he's got a few. Oh, and here comes the rain again. Here comes, <laughs> here comes the rain in the hill. <laughs> they're small. Small. But they're chrome red rib. Red rib. Chrome That's what I'm rib. fishing, a All 16. Right. Look at the squall. Look at no. the Here comes the hail this. again. Oh, oh, gee. Here comes the hail. Here it comes. <laughs> In a big way. Oh, look at that. There's a bulldog over there. He's got one. Oh, a clear sky there, but right above us, we got this big, big pile of hail coming at us. Oh, gee. Yeah. <laughs> oh, Dale's hooked up too. Really? Is it? Bulldog's on. All right. And Brian's got his over here. Yeah, yeah there's a nice one, Brian. It's fighting good. Oh, yeah. Nice little standard size guy. Sure scrappy though, aren't they? Yeah, oh yeah. Oh. Okay, that's a nice one. Not huge, but just nice size. Yeah. Okay, Brian, you know what we're doing? We're going to the bench. I'm going to go to the bench right now and tie that fly. Nice. Beautiful. Yeah, beautiful. Little guy. Beautiful. There he's there gone. Let's get him in here. Oh, okay. We're back. Let's see what. Okay. Fly out. 
and then I think we'll get a throat sample. Come on, where's the fly? Right there. Side lip. There, fly oh, it's up. a nice chunky fish. Oh yeah, he's a nice little fish. Look at him in the... So what do you think? Do you want to throw a sample this guy or do you want to wait for the next one? Yeah, this we'll guy. wait for the next one. Yeah, that guy's kind of Let him go. Yeah, there he goes. There. Excellent. <laughs> we're starting to come on, Brian. Even with this crappy weather, oh, I think we're all right. Yeah, we're we got to take advantage of these breaks in the weather. <laughs> no kidding. Look at us. <laughs> and to me, we're bundled. All right. A little lunch break, Brian. I finally had to eat while I had a chance because the sun has peaked out briefly. <laughs> So we got a chance, so I'm going to have a little lunch. Well, you explained to everybody why this fishing is so good in here now. Well, you know, Penasca, or sorry, Tonko Lake is one of the most renowned small lakes in the province. It gets huge amounts of angler effort, provincial park on it, beautiful resort, a good day use access to the lake as well, and there's also private cabins on the lake. But actually, Tonko is quite a unique lake for its size. It's it's 240 acres, I think, it, or a little bit bigger, but the maximum depth's only like 22 feet. Yeah. So, so the mean depth of this lake is like 10 feet. So it's a huge shoal when you think about it. Really? Yeah. Like when the, when the sun does shine, <laughs> there, there's a lot of vegetation grows in the lake. It's a, it's a, it's a phenomenal chronomid lake, uh, and then it has a huge bomber hatch of chronomids in August. And uh, for many, many years, the uh, provincial government used Tunko Lake as a Penasque egg collection site. Oh, okay. So it was okay. a backup for Penasque Lake. Yeah. And uh, it was switched about uh, 15, 16 years ago into Blackwaters because we started stocking Blackwaters into the lake to use Tunko as a, a extra brood source in case the uh, Dragon Lake egg collection, ah, which is black waters, okay. didn't meet the quota. Uh, but about 11 years ago, the province decided the fisheries program to switch back to Penasque. And uh, now we have uh, Tunker producing some beautiful Penasque. It's also now a backup lake for Penasque. So each year, uh, Tunker gets stocked with 40,000 yearling Penasque. Wow, 40,000. Wow. 35,000 of those are all female. Mm -hmm. So they're diploid, but they're all female. And 5,000 are all female triploid. Wow. So there's, we know there's some fish in the six pound range in this lake. You know, they didn't want to show themselves uh, today for <laughs> us, but that's, that's hey, the weather. There's still some day left here. <laughs> I mean, in between school, we've got the perfect time to have lunch. Hopefully it stays sunny. And then hopefully we'll get some more. I think we've still got a half a day left. Yeah, no, it's, I mean, there's lots of fish in the lake. It's just, we've had some pretty challenging weather conditions today. <laughs> well, Chandler, I think that's it, eh? Oh, we've had every, I mean, we, the only thing we didn't bring today for this trip was a snow shovel. Oh, it's amazing how much hail <laughs> we had in the boat at one point. Everybody saw it. It was a crazy day. You know, it started off sunny. Came out, Brian says, this was not the weather expected. Beautiful sun, clouds came in, squall after squall, oh. wind, everything. And then now it's nice, but it's, you know, it's almost four o'clock. The fish were off, they're done. Yeah, yeah, it was, well, you know, we had to do a lot of casting, different flies, yeah. wet lines. And um, got, we got a few on chronomid, but just when those chronomids started to go, the squalls came in and yeah. they just shut them down. That's the way it goes. And also the Freshwater Fishery Society, we should thank them for putting all the fish in the lake. Oh, no, the society does a great job stocking Tunkwa and a thousand other lakes in the province. Yeah. And the, you know, the neat thing about it is now when you buy your license, 100% of that revenue goes to the Freshwater Fish Society to help deliver the provincial stocking program, assessment work, fishing docks, public access, improving public access, and they work in conjunction with the Provincial Fisheries Program. It's a great, it's a great partnership. Oh yeah, you get these great fisheries like Tonkwa. And also I want to thank Tonkwa Lake Resort. They gave us uh, a boat for the bulldog to use. You know, he was, he was doing a lot of the camera work this time, <laughs> catching fish after fish oh, on, no. you know, double using, headers. Double headers, using those darn, those darn attractor patterns. They're always a winner. <laughs> but when you come out here, Take care, conserve our waters, and we'll see you next time we take a sport fishing on the fly.
Yeah, Chatter. Hey. <laughs>